Well, we are enjoying the spots, Senzo and myself. You can see Tandi just in front of us, Tingana to the right. Hosanna is coming up with speed behind us, apparently. I haven't seen him yet, but apparently he's walking straight on the same trail of these two and following in behind. Now, interestingly enough, I reckon us crashing through the bush might just attract little Tumba this way, and we might soon see a little leopard fiesta or fiasco as tar i mean taylor once called it that was i heard all about that now i'm just going to try and see if i can get around because oh without hitting myself in the face that will probably be more preferable <clears throat> okay senzo hold on the problem with these two leopards is once we lose sight of them we're going to have a big problem so that's why i'm trying to get around things quite quickly before they cross because otherwise we're not going to be able to keep up with them but here is a road which is fantastic news yeah. hopefully the two of them are sitting on the road but it's not likely i'm pretty sure they're crossing although the nice thing is i know where they're going there we go there they go go up on the mound come on tandy up on your mound come on but interesting as well, other than Tandi and, and Tingana and Tamba and, and Hosanna to worry about, we also have to think that the Nkuhumas are on Twin Dams. Now we are heading straight to Twin Dams Road. Now if they turn north up Twin Dams Road, there might then potentially be a collision course between Leopard and Lion. Now what have you seen, Tandi? No, nothing to worry about. Okay, Senzo, there's going to be a slight bump. Slight being probably a gross exaggeration as what's about to happen, so hold on. Oh, there we go. So, so Tara apparently also was talking about leopards and lions, if they encounter one another, what actually happens and whether or not they engage with one another. Well, lions most certainly will chase leopards hands down every single time. And as Tara mentioned, the sticks are leopard haters of note. They've killed at least one leopard that I know of, possibly two. So, and I know that this morning they were chasing Anderson male. So Anderson male has had a rough week. I think he was chased by the Inkahumas and then he was chased by the sticks as well. So... It does happen from time to time. I have seen also, funny enough, down in the south of the reserve, there was a male leopard called the Chilunga male. Now, I'm not sure if any of you have ever heard of Chilunga male, but Chilunga male was an interesting individual. He developed a habit of hunting leopard cubs, I mean lion cubs, and he managed to get himself four lion cubs before a female le lion actually got him. So he was played a dangerous game and he actually lost the game in the end. Oh, Tandi, you look so pretty in this light. Don't know, is that okay to say to a leopard? I'm not quite sure. Hopefully she likes it. Now, where is Tingana? I think she's also lost sight of Tingana, much like we have at this stage. I hear a Franklin calling here, though. Is, do you see him, Senzo? Oh, there he is in front. Okay, I can see him now as well. So you see she's listening now to the Franklin as well. So the Franklin caught my ear, and so did it catch Tandy's ear. So Tandy's just checking to see is there anything there. And then Tingana, like I say, is just in front of us. But they are heading into the Mulawati and their direction has definitely changed. We're heading now in a much more northerly direction. And so hopefully we're not going to get... Where am I going to go from here? You know what, Senzo? Let's change direction here slightly. What's she running after? She's running after something. See. Now, I don't know what she's chasing, but she's chasing something. You can see her just running in front here. I'm trying to get through as quick as I can, but it is not easy in here. What have you seen? She's seen something. Look at how she's twitching her tail. Franklin is alarm calling. I don't know where Tingana has gone from now, but she's definitely spotted an opportunity potentially for food. The way her body language has changed is not that of spotting Tingana. There, she's chasing a diker. That's what she's chasing. Let's see, she, I saw the diker just bolt off. Let's see if we can keep up with her. Not only have we have mating leopards, we have hunting leopards, lions on the move. Oh, it's all happening today. I'm going to try and sneak through here somehow. Now, of course, if Tandi does kill this, even if Tingana's not here now, he's going to come running in here and come and take that kill if she did manage. 
Now where did she go? I saw her running this way. Exquisite bliss, you say, go get it, girl. Well, I agree, but don't get it so fast that we can't find you. Now, where's she gone? Oh, no. This is not going well. Now, there's a number of people that are trying to call me on the radio as well, that are trying to find me, but I've lost sight of Tandy. Now, I'm going to try and see if I can't find Tandy quickly, and while we do that, let's go back to Tara and her lioness.